Summers. It's your family yeah. out there? Oh, you're talking like a daytime talk show host. Huh? Yes, really. But I want to tell you. But you're bonding with them. <laughs> yes, I am. Let's, so let's nice. talk about our feelings. <laughs> Are you doing all those things? Well, you're only your second show now, right? But I know I've done 27 of them. Oh, you They're cheat. In the you can. do them ahead of time. Oh, yeah. that's where some yeah. of mine are. Yeah. 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 <laughs> now, where were you just now? Were you just at Step by Step? I was at Step by Step. I was almost late coming here because um, when you work with kids, I have six kids and I'm pregnant this year. Having my seventh one. You look like you've had seven kids. Yeah, yeah. right. <laughs> I think most women have seven children. Look, it's not like this. Yeah. yeah. That, it's that thigh uh -huh. thing you work it's out with. It's that thigh with. thing, yeah, yes. Yeah. That's why we give you that uh, thigh master before you leave, because you can do that in bed while you're eating the Hagen and it yeah. balances one another out. You sent me one, you know. Yes, I know. Yeah. I know. And she autographed to, uh, it. Yeah, Jim, oh, your really? writer. Oh, really? Yeah, she yes. did. And uh, it said on, on the thigh master, it says, just be, put it between your legs and squeeze. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> Hey, it worked, you know. <laughs> uh, anyway, I was over at Step by Step, mm -hmm. and there's a new thing. You learn all sorts of things with kids, and uh, the new thing now is fake snot. No, fake snot? Fake snot. Fake snot is cool. And uh, we have these characters on the show that are sort of stolen from another show called uh, Beavis and, and Butt Scratch. And, uh, Gee, I wonder where they stole that idea yes, from. Yes, I wonder, I, I wonder. Mm -hmm. And uh, so they walk around with a fake snot, and they miss and got fake snot all over me. And um, so I was desnotting myself. Oh, yes. Right. So, you know, yes. That's really why I like the real snot. You know, the fake stuff is okay, <laughs> but I, I don't think uh, you, you miss out a lot. Really. Yes, I know, I know. But it comes right off. It comes off in strings, so mothers don't get upset. It, it, it's like it that feels slime wet. stuff. Yeah, it's like so it feels wet when it first gets on, and then when it dries, you can just pull it off. Oh, that's, that's good to know. That's charming. Yeah, I've learned I've learned words like uh, "whoa, dude" and things like that. Oh, that's good. I, I, I hang around with uh, fourteen-year-olds. <laughs> yeah. Now let me ask you: Did you? I, I, well, I knew you wanted to be an actress. And was yeah. the talk show thing? I mean, is that what you always wanted to do? Talk show eventually? Or you just know, when I when I was seventeen years old, mm -hmm. I was with Alan, my husband, and um, he took me to an island called Eleuthera in the Bahamas. And we weren't married yet. And, no, you're uh, 17. That would be against the law now. That would be... Uh, <laughs> true, that's under true. Under the Mann Act, he could be in prison, <laughs> taking an underage true. woman to another country. I never thought about for that. For purposes right. of uh, that was, whatever. Um, okay, uh, so go ahead. That, uh, yeah, was a that, a child that going with an older man to, yeah. a, to another island. And yes, and he is, he's old. And uh, <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, he took me to this island, and um, <laughs> this other couple was there, and she's now my best friend, but she's 15 years older than I am, and she mm -hmm. said to me, she takes a look at me, and I'm sitting on the beach with the blonde hair and the green bikini, and she said, what do you want to do when you grow up? And I said, well, I'd like to do what Johnny Carson does someday. Uh -huh. So this was a long time ago. So I, I walked out onto the show the first day, and I thought, it's not what Johnny Carson does, but... It's my own version of it. Yeah, so I'm really okay. And you have it, a band yeah. and all that stuff. I have a band. Yeah. Uh, Brantford, are they paying you well here? Um, no, they're not. <laughs> because? <laughs> not a, well, right now, no. Actually, yeah, ever... I've got a warehouse of thigh masters that you could sell on the side. Oh, I yeah. <laughs> now, see, no, I've got a live band, and it's headed by Glenn Zatola, who's an oh, incredible I wish, saxophonist. wish I had a live band. <laughs> <laughs> You were talking about your cat, um, right. and I and it rem I was thinking in your monologue that um, our cat watches us make love also, and it is so. Really? Yeah, so well, I don't set it up for that way. I'm just saying. It. I know, but I, I mean, you'll be lying in bed, and the cat. Well, we don't go, oh, cat. Okay, watch, kitty. You know, I think it, I mean, it's not, we don't set it up that way. You're not trying to make the cat watch. But they do. They watch, sort of a detached way. But all of a sudden, you'll hear. <laughs> Now that's Alan. <laughs> that's your husband. Oh, I'm sorry. And you hear the yeah. cat. They're weird. They're weird. And then there's this thing, that kneading thing. You know, when you have cats? What, yeah. What's the kneading thing about? Uh, you know, I don't know, but I will look at the cat a whole different way now. Yeah, yeah. You know, see, I always thought you wanted to be, uh, well, they called them weather girls back in those days. What would you say? A, a meteorologist now? Well, I, I tried out at KRON in San Francisco mm -hmm. when I was around 19 to be the weather girl. And I tried out again when I was in my early 20s. I kept trying. I never got the job. Yeah. So that, that was... I, you know, if you know if I had gotten that job, yeah. I never would have done anything else. That would have been a great job. Do you know that's job. an NBC affiliate? 
K-R-O-N? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And the nice thing about it is, you see, it's NBC, so I called up there, uh -huh. and they were kind enough to send me your audition tape. Oh. Would you like to see it? This is great. This is great. Oh, I have it. I have it. Yeah. Yes, I do. You do? Yes, I do. I have it. This is, my, like, 16, 18. Take a look at this. Here we go. Here you, you are. Do. Now, watch carefully. The she temperatures does the work. around the Bay Area today will continue like they have been to be very, very moderate. In San Francisco, we have 58 degrees, as I said. In the Napa Vallejo um, area, it will be 47. So it's a little bit cooler up there. In um, this place here, Livermore, <laughs> it will be 54 degrees. And in San Mateo, they'll have a little bit warmer than usual. It'll be 61 degrees. Very Kind of the, I've never seen that. That actually made me hyperventilate. Kind of, an, <laughs> really? kind of the early love boat orange yeah, it was. That's right, that's right, with a little scarf, that ascot. And thing. down in this place here, it's like I'm 80. <laughs> I'm right. uh, <laughs> trying to find it. You so when, backwards. Now, to be a weather, well, you weren't really a meteorologist, so you didn't have to have any... Do you have to write backwards? Yeah, that, that was the thing. If you could read backwards, yeah. you could you could do that. Callie Lang used to be the one up there, although oh, yeah, she was, had a different name then. Oh, really? She's our news person? Yes, yes. And didn't you do this, too, on, uh, on, on, on TV on show? Then, then on the anniversary game, I walked. I got a job as a prize model. I was the host of the show called An Anniversary Game, and my job was to point to the refrigerator, you know, like Carol Merrill. Oh, yeah, yeah. And um, I kept looking at the wrong camera because I didn't know there was a red light on the one you're supposed to look at so I'd be looking over here and and showing the refrigerator <laughs> and the stage man would be going like this and then I'd get over to that one and this one would be over here and uh, I got fired that day but um, <laughs> but the host took me out for dinner. Can you point us to yeah. a commercial? Point uh, us right out. Uh, uh, we'll be back. <laughs>